Now I'm riding across to my Palayan to do the boat launch and I notice all these like scallops here. You can see a, like a channel there and a channel here. So the water is definitely coming over on the high tide. Um, how far it's going down looks like it could be entering the system. But one of the challenges that we have is that there's very hot berg wind conditions and extremely strong wind is also evaporating the water quickly. Um, I heard it many years ago that on a strong northeasterly wind on a hot day up to 5% of the surface area can be um, evaporated. Seems like a lot but uh, even 2%, 1%, still a lot of water being removed. And you can see how it's moved back. There's the color line there that it used to be and already it's dropped back down to the bottom there. So yeah, interesting. Looks like the weatherman got it right, a bit of rain coming. Beautiful map line there and you can see the black clouds at the back. It's crazy how flat the sea is today. Equipment that works well makes it so much easier. boat launching this morning and it's such a beautiful day and there's not even white water over the back of that reef it's kind of scary in a way for the skipper because obviously he doesn't know where it is. But so long as he knows where those markers on the duna, he'll know where the end of the reef is. It is high tide, so even if you had to make a mistake, there's a good chance that you'll be okay. But literally, it's like a whole dam this morning. Look at that. First wave that boat hit today. There comes one. Gonna go around it though, yep. There you go. Job done. Why is he just making space for the boys? As that's happening, Asterix has arrived and ocean commotion coming there in the distance. So my I've just removed the tree stump. And he's got to help out there because obviously that tree stump got in the way and lost momentum. Why is he now on his way quickly to help Ocean Commotion there? They got jammed up in that soft sand. Locked and loaded. It makes for quite a pretty picture this contrast to the glow of the sea and the dark dark clouds in the background and what I mean 
mention about going over the reef with the high tide you get enough water and you no problem that's the example i was talking about I think he got himself in a bit of a pickle there this morning. Because now there's not enough space at the back to get the tractor in. That should do it. I need to reload the hole. See what I mean? Why is he almost has to go into the into the bush there? Maybe once again the views are just amazing with the, the clouds at the back. careful about I'm not gonna steal my airtime. the reef coming through a lot more white water over the top of the reef there little kingy on here but uh, whilst I've got him on just look at this sky all right let me go back to to my job here land this fish 